everybody, welcome back to my channel. So we have a special guest today, and it is Gucci Salazar. This is my puppy. He's a French bulldog. He's a little camera shy, but he is 10 months right now. And so he's not up in a year, but we've had him for a good like eight months. But I just wanted to do a video today on everything you need to know before getting a French Bulldog. And I know before I got him, I made sure to do a lot of research, so I figured this video might be useful for some of y'all. Looking into getting a French Bulldog, um, or any Bulldog, like an English Bulldog or anything, because I know they are similar. Um, and I wanna have him right here, but he's being, Gucci, you wanna treat? Okay, I'm trying to have him sit still, but he wants to go with his dad, who is in the other room. But here is what he looks like. Hi! <laughs> His ears are so big, he's like, let me down. <laughs> he just woke up from a nap, so he's a little bit crazy right now. My mom sent me an article saying like French Bulldogs are very popular in the US right now. They're like number one dog this year or something like that. And I didn't get my French Bulldog and the state got him overseas. So the first thing, you need to know before getting a French Bulldog is their nose. Their nose is very, um, it gets dry and chapped easily. So I recommend buying like the snout nose, it's like a nose chapstick that we put on Gucci's nose daily. And I don't have it with me because we just got run out of it, but we did buy a whole tub of it. Um, and you get it on Amazon. I'll have all the products linked down below. Nothing is sponsored by the way This is actually like the products that we use for Gucci and his nose to keep it perfect. We have another special guest My husband <laughs> Gucci will only stay in here if Nick is in here, so The second thing you need to know before getting a French Bulldog is that they have smelly farts and I, I actually saw this online in, on another video, um, but I didn't think anything of it. And then we got Gucci and his farts stink really, really bad. And I'm talking about like, like three or four every few hours. So he farts a lot. And his diet is turkey and rice, dog food. So I know it's not anything we're feeding him because it's healthy. They just have, they're known for having smelly farts. And then the third thing you need to know before getting a French Bulldog is that they're very needy and affectionate. And this is, this varies from dog to dog because every dog has their own personality. Look how cute he is. <laughs> oh my goodness. He has separation anxiety. But again, that's our dog. Your dog might be different. And then the fourth thing you need to know before getting a French Bulldog is that to potty train him with dog bells, him or her, if you get a girl French Bulldog. But one of the girls that lives around me, she has a French Bulldog too, and they're around the same age, and I asked her what she used to potty train him, and she used these dog bells. So basically- It's like a, it's a ton of bells on one string, and we hang it on the door handle, and every time he goes outside, we would use his paws, uh, to hit the doorbell and then we'd open the door uh, just so he knows that that means go outside and to use the restroom use outside restroom. Um, and then we would always tell him go outside go use the restroom it, it took him like three months yeah to get it took him three months but it took my mom's dog like a week a or two a couple of days but, but that, that's not a Frenchie that varies with dog too um, so your dog might be a little bit different. We really like that potty train system. And we live on a, um, a high floor. So we got him, my college advisor actually told me about this. Um, it's like a little grass pad that I put on the patio. You can clean the bottom tray. When he needs to use the restroom, he'll just ring the bell and we take him outside. And the fifth thing you need to know is that Frenchies sleep a lot so much i didn't realize they slept that much yeah he takes like three or four naps a day oh those are the doorbell see he needs the restroom sleep a lot and i didn't realize that um but it's nice it's nice having somebody to nap with you 
The sixth thing you need to know before getting a French Bulldog is that they require a lot of attention. He likes to be the center of attention. I guess this goes with they're very needy and affectionate. They're very lovable dogs. I recommend them. The seventh thing you need to know before getting a French Bulldog is that they have many health issues. So I know they only live, but we looked it up in the lifespan of them about 15 to 20 years, right? Yeah. And then on Google, it said that the longest living Frenchie was only 18 years old. So they don't live that long and they also have a lot of health issues and knowing that they come with health problems. Um, but that doesn't stop a lot of people. That didn't stop us from getting a French Bulldog. And I know a lot of people who have Frenchies. So that doesn't stop most people. So I wanted to show y'all some of the products that we use for Gucci. All of this stuff I'll put in the description. But this is the paw soother we use and it treats dry itchy and rough paws and it is the brand by the natural dog company and here's what it looks like and then this is the same brand we use for his nose cream um, we just ordered more or else I'd show y'all here's the second thing we use it is called wrinkle paste it cleans and protects dog wrinkles tears tear stains and tail pockets but we really only use it for his tear stains. The poop bags um, we use are the earth rated ones that the lavender scented ones. I like that they're scented. I just put them um, in my fanny pack whenever we go take him on walks. And I know the, they sell these at like TJ Maxx and um, Marshalls and stuff. So you can get them there too if you don't want to get it on Amazon. Because I think they're a little bit more expensive on Amazon. And then here are the treats that Gucci loves. The Milk Bone Soft and Chewy Chicken Recipe ones. And I know they have peanut butter ones, uh, but these ones are his favorite. And the puppy supplies I got was his bed, puppy pads, and the two doorbells. Oh, and also a lot of toys. He has a lot of toys. Right now he's playing with his tennis ball right now. And he didn't like tennis balls when he was little, but he likes them now. But yeah, guys, that is all for this video. Thank y'all so much for watching. It was very short and simple and to the point, um, but I purposely made it like that. Thank y'all so much for watching, and I'll see y'all in my next video. Bye-bye.